Some brands we know by their logos, but most we know by their names. Brand names can come from anywhere, really. Something that inspires the founder. Some very famous names have some very unexpected origins. First up, Amazon. More to prime. Their rise began with a name that put them on top alphabetically. Amazon was originally Kadabra, which sounds like cadaver. So they changed the name to meet the Yahoo search engine criteria, which was alphabetical at the time. So Amazon would get them higher up in the search ratings. Second, unlike Amazon, Starbucks wasn't selling books, but they got their name from one. The founders of Starbucks turned to Moby Dick for their moniker. The founders originally wanted to call it Pequot, but some of the other co-founders said, no, that's not a great name. So they named it after another character in Moby Dick, Starbucks. Third. Virgin. Together, we will turn our wonderful dreams into reality. Sir Richard may have dreams that are out of this world, but Virgin started in a basement. Sir Richard Branson and his co-founders thought that they were virgins in the music industry, so why not be Virgin? And the final brand name with an interesting origin, IKEA. Hundreds of ways to rediscover the joy of the kitchen. The Scandinavian company name is pieced together like one of their pieces of furniture. IKEA is based off the original founder's name, so vanity's sake, basically. It's his first name, last name, the village in which he grew up in, and the form in which he was raised on. Brand names, and from whence they came, on the lowdown.